Welcome to this edition of Sudoku Perma Videos, where we solve without candidates. This is puzzle number 90 from Sudoku to Go, volume 150. It's a diabolical skill level, and we'll use a combination of twins and triplets to find a couple of numbers when we uh, really have a difficult time uh, when it gets when this puzzle gets very difficult. Before I get started, I want to uh, let you know about a new feature, and that is now you can print the puzzle and solution for each new video. Go to the description in the video and look for um, print this puzzle and solution, and there will be a link to a web page where you can print the puzzle. And so you can print the puzzle and the solution, or just the puzzle if you'd like. And then you can uh, either follow along as I solve it, or try solving it before you watch the video. Oh, and uh, by the way, don't tell anyone, but the printable puzzles may just be out a day or two before the video comes out. Today's puzzle was put out there on Tuesday this week. So you may be able to look at the puzzle before this video is even pu published if you'd like to. Just go check on the website for the uh, printable puzzles for the upcoming video. All right, well, let's get started here. We're going to put in a, a bunch of easy numbers. 888, eight, eight. there's a 4 right there, and here's a Three right here. And now let's look at column four here. We're missing two, seven, eight, and nine. There's a two and an eight there, and a two and an eight here. So that's a seven, nine, seven or nine. That's a seven or nine. And these are two eight twins, so we have two eights and seven nines. We can solve the seven nines because of that seven there. But I uh, can't solve the two eights yet. These are one and six right here. All right, now let's look at column six. We're missing two, six, eight, nine. Here's a 9, so that's 2, 6, or 8. Well, here's a 6, 8, 9, so that's a 2. Uh, these can't be 6 because of that 6, so that's a 6 right there. And we're, we have 8 and 9 left. With that 8, we can fill those in. And we're left with 5 and 7 right here, 5, 7. All right, now we know these are five seven twins. We've got a five here going through this gate, this gate pattern here. A five going through the gate with a five here, so we know one of these is a five. So we have five ghost fives, five, and five seven there, so one of these is a five. And uh, let's see, you got one here and a one here, so that's a one right there. So we know this is a 5, and four, we're missing 4 and 7 there. So we have 4, 7 twins there. So right now we have 5, 7, and this is these are two 7s, and 1, 6, and 2, 8 as far as twins go. Let's look at this cell right here. Let's see what numbers it can see and cannot see. One, two, three. It can't see a three. Four. We have ghost fives here. Six. Sevens here. Eight, nine. So that's a three. A three is the only number that that cell can't see. So we'll put a three right there. And we've got 
Um, <clears throat> let's see, we're missing two, two, eight, and nine here. We've got a two and an eight there, so that's a nine. So we got two, eight there. We can't solve those yet. And here in box nine, we've got a nine here, nine here, nine, nine. So that's a nine right there. And we've also got four, four, four. So that's a four. And at this point, we're getting pretty stuck. We we have some things we know about. We have two eights there, five sevens, two sevens, a five there. Uh, one six two eight uh, but that's about all we know so far so let's look at um let's look at row nine here let's see we're missing one two six seven and eight oh look at this there's a two seven and eight there so that's a one or a six and remember our one six twins here. So we have one six twins here. Okay, that'll help us a little bit. Now we're missing two seven and eight here. There's an two there, so that's a seven or an eight. These are two eight, and this is a two or a seven because there's an eight right there. All right. Oh, and look at this. We have these two seven twins here. So these are two seven twins right there. And these are one, two, three, six, three, six twins here. We can't solve any of those yet, but two sevens and three sixes there. One six twins there, one six, two, eight. Okay. Um, let's see what else we can see here. Let's look at column three right here. What we've got, we know that can't be a one because we have one six twins right there. Neither of these can be a one because of that one in that box. So this can't be a one, these can't be a one. This, this one right here can't be a one because there's a one there. So we can put a one right here. All right. We know this is a four or a seven because we have four seven twins there. This is a seven or an eight because remember our two seven eights, two um, seven eight, two seven two eight two seven. We have four seven seven eight. Let's look at these three right here. Well, let's see what we're missing here. One two three four five eight nine. A four, five, and eight. Let's see what we're missing right here. Three, four, five. We have ghost sixes here because we have a six there and six there. So we can see one, two, three. We can't see a four, five, six, seven, eight. We can't see an eight, and there's a nine. So that's a four or an eight. Oh, look at that. So we've got four, seven, four, eight, seven, eight. So these are five, six right here. So let's fill those in because we got a six right there. And you notice we had to find these one, six twins in order to determine that this can't be a one right there in order to narrow that down to a seven or eight. And then we had these triplets, four, seven, four eight seven eight and that leaves five and six that we could fill in so now we got a five there also five five and five there so that's a five all right and now these two eights, can we solve them? We got a two there, two. Well, there's an eight, and we got a wall pattern right here. So one of these has to be an eight. There's an eight there. So eight, ghost eights. So that's got to be an eight. 
and this is a 2. Okay, we're only missing a 3 right there, so I'll just put that in. All right, now we're missing 1, 2, 4. Yeah, 2 and 4 here. We've got a 4 there, so we can fill those in. All right, and now let's see. Seven to seven. Oh, we've got a gate pattern right here with a two going through it, with a two there. So one of these has to be a two. Let's see. So that can't be a two. That's got to be a seven. Because we have ghost twos there. So that makes that a two. Seven and two there. That makes that a two. Because remember our two seven twins and our three six twins there. So that makes that a two. All right. And with that seven, we can fill in the five and seven in box two here. All right. Now we're only missing two numbers in row one. That's two and six. There's a two, so we can fill those in. All right, and remember our one six is here and one six is there. There's a six there now, so we can put a one there, six, one. And we can fill in the two eights there because of that two. And the only number left here is a 7. All right, there's a 7 right there. That makes that a 4. And we've got 1, 1. So that's a 1 right there. 1, 1 with a 1 there. All right, now let's see what we're missing here. Five, nine. So we can fill those in. Because of that five, we can fill those in. Now we got a nine here, nine here. So that's a nine right there. And we're missing four and eight there. There's a four right there. So all right. All right, what are we missing here? Three, six, eight. Three, six, and eight. There's a three in here. That's a loner cell with a three there, so that's a three. And then there's an eight here, so we can put eight there and six there. All right, we're missing six and seven here. And only missing the seven in that row. So we can complete those. And now we're missing three, seven there. And we're missing three and six there. I think we got it. Well, there you have it. Uh, when you can't find the next number, keep in mind that twins and triplets used together may just be the thing that get you going again. Noticing uh, twins and triplets together or, or other techniques that you could use together will help you find numbers you probably wouldn't find otherwise. Well, until next video, have a great week.